Episode 16 of Love Next Door begins this K-drama with Seok Ryu and Seong Hayu's family sharing breakfast. Meanwhile, Dan Ho visits Mo Yun's workplace to pick her up and discovers her reassignment to the South Pole, though he keeps this information to himself. The two go on their first date to an amusement park, while Mi Suk, Hai Suk and their friends gather at Mo Yun's mother's office and learn about Seong Hayu and Seok Ryu's relationship. Mi Suk and Hai Suk then start bickering over wedding plans, from the location to the finer details. Seok Ryu later to meet Mo Yun, who admits she's unsure how to tell Dan Ho about her reassignment. Seok Ryu advises her to be honest before leaving to meet Seong Hayu. Meanwhile, Mi Suk teaches Hai Suk how to cook in exchange for English lessons, each flaunting their skills while subtly belittling each other. Simultaneously, Seong Hayu's father gives Seok Ryu's father a photography lesson, which quickly escalates into a comedic alcohol-fueled scuffle. Later, Mo Yun shows Dan Ho the family t-shirt she bought for everyone, while Dan Ho gifts her the clothes for her South Pole trip, fully supporting supportive of her decision. Yondu also encourages Mo Yun to go and send pictures of Emperor Penguins. Seok Ryu's online channel starts gaining traction with positive feedback on her recipes. As she and Seong Hayu stroll down memory lane, they come across her father's food shop, now newly renovated. Seong Hayu reveals that this is Seok Ryu's new restaurant, which he secretly remodeled at the request of her father. This touching gesture leaves Seok Ryu emotional. Meanwhile, Dong Jin prepares for his exam, with Na Young cheering him on and even asking him to be her personal trainer once he passes. The group throws a small farewell party for Mo Yun, and the next day she leaves for the South Pole. Seok Ryu opens her restaurant, called Rainbow Kitchen, and asks her father to be the advisor. She even develops an app for the restaurant herself. The two later try on wedding outfits, but in a surprise twist, Seok Ryu requests to postpone their wedding by a year due to her workload. Hyseok's wedding is held eventually though, with Seok Ryu and Seong Hayu sharing a sweet kiss at the celebration. Months later, Seong Hayu is appointed as a public architect for Seoul, while Seok Ryu wins the prestigious Orange Ribbon Award just six months after opening her restaurant. Yondu wins a kindergarten coding competition and aspires to work for NASA. Dong Jin becomes a certified personal trainer with Na Yun as his first client. Meanwhile, Seok Ryu and Seong Hayu's fathers have become close friends, regularly playing badminton together. Mo Yun is still at the South Pole but stays in touch with her family, and Dan Ho plans to visit her to cover a story. Seong Hayu's firm is thriving, just like the pomegranate tree Seok Ryu gave him. And then the episode concludes with Seong Hayu and Seok Ryu playfully arguing about their new house but resolving to hold hands through it all. They walk together towards their future hand in hand, ending things on a lovely night. The finale of Love Next Door ends on a heartwarming feel-good note, neatly tying up all the loose ends. Every character finds a happy ending, leaving viewers with a strong emotional high. Though the finale is predictable, it's pretty satisfying, focusing on positivity and resolution for all of our characters. Many feel-good moments showcase not just Seong Hayu and Seok Ryu, but their families and friends as well which is commendable for a series with such a broad ensemble cast. However, there are notable references to other dramas, including a scene reminiscent of Once Again, featuring No Gain No Love star Lee Sang-Yi's 2020 family drama. This reinforces the sense that while Love Next Door excels in execution and casting, it often relies on predictable tropes and recycled plot lines. In the end, Love Next Door offers a decent and satisfying finale, leaving a feel-good vibe even if it doesn't quite reach phenomenal heights. Thanks for watching and do let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Smash a like or subscribe to the channel, your support is very much appreciated. I'm Greg Wheeler and from all of us over here at The Review Geek, we'll see you on the next video.